think this counts as a, su a substantial happening to where uh, both A, I can increase my battery, which would be greatly appreciated. I have like 900 crystal charges, so it's it's overdue. Um, but also, I think I, I have enough to uh, get another heart container, and this was a, a big thing. Um, I mean, the fact that I was able to do this in one recording session, I think, speaks volumes. The, this was a very productive recording session. Um, it kept moving, and I'm happy with that. Uh, as for next episode, I don't think I'm going to go back to the depths. This, is, this isn't much to accomplish. Well, we're probably going to grab that, too. Uh, but this isn't a whole lot to accomplish, but... We can we can save that for later. This has been enough episodes. We can we can move on. Um, we're going to be doing the fabled episode that I've been looking forward to. The recording session I've been looking forward to. All the comments you guys have left telling me to go to a specific stable to get things moving, a lot of quests moving. That's gonna happen. Oh, hi. That's fun. Oh. You know I'm gonna keep my normal gear equipped because I'm not gonna run into. Did that respawn? I've been there. Yeah, I, I've been there. I'm not gonna fight that again. I don't need to fight that again. Uh, <clears throat> is That's all gonna happen. We're gonna go to the stables and make that work. And we're gonna be juggling a lot next episode because we have three active quests going on. Um, and we're gonna be revisiting a lot of locales uh, that we've seen above ground with all of the glyphs if I'm able to unlock that this next episode. So it's, it's gonna be fun. It's gonna be a really fun episode. I, I'm really looking forward to it. I've been looking forward to it for two whole recording sessions now, um, above completing Tulin's quest. So that's gonna be really cool. It's gonna it's gonna be really bopping. Uh, what is down there? Nothing. Uh, we're almost to this light route. I don't see it though. Where on earth is this thing? There it is. I don't think it's going to reveal anything either. It, this is really just complete, although... Okay, we haven't gotten that. That is a Yiga base, so we'll, we'll do that real quick. At this point, I'm just kind of wrapping up the session. Tying up a couple loose ends, so we don't have to tie them up later. I'll go grab that Yiga base, and then we'll go to the, the other gap. I think this is a new a new guy. Because we haven't, we haven't had a Blood Moon. I, although, have we seen a Blood Moon underground? I don't think we have. So this guy, I could have gotten this guy before. Turn around. That is the wrong way, dude. Wait for it, wait for it, wait for it, and... Boom. Hi, buddy. I have not beaten this guy before. And he's gonna start things off correctly. What weapon do I have? Oh, this one's good. All right, let's get this going. That's just enough reach. Let's not be greedy, don't be greedy. Oh, this is awkward. That's fine. Aha! <laughs> uh, Froxes are child's play now. There's one. Come on. One more hit. Whoa, I'm inside of him. Oh, I have a fairy. That was awkward. That was really weird. I clipped inside of him. Okay, he's gonna jump. Okay, I didn't shield bash it, but I blocked it. I didn't shield bash it, but I blocked it. <laughs> I'm not sure if I can shield bash that. He's gonna jump again. I think I, I, I'm pretty sure I got the shield bash timing on that down. Because it actually did the fire thing, and my shield would be dead otherwise. They're actually hurting him. That's weird. And skrbloosh. And goodbye. 
I'm pretty sure. I'm pretty sure I finally got that. Because this thing, this shield, took three hits. One of them was proper, but the other two dealt the did the fire explosion, and it's not badly damaged. I finally got it. I'm so happy with myself. It took at the end of a recording session how many frocks is having been fought, but I did it. And I'm going to end this with a bunch of more Zonite. I'm probably going to be right back to where I was before I, I spent a bunch. And then we'll have a, we'll have one more lifer to get. And then we're going back to Lookout Landing just real quick. We're not starting ne next episode from there, uh, but we are going to go back there. You, sir, are also not necessary. And that's that. I wonder how many Yiga clan members there actually are, because they never die. We've never killed a Yiga clan member. They've always just teleported away. So, in essence, there could be like five of them. Uh, oh, got it. I'm eager to learn more about the, the incredible new power that has captured Master Koga's attention. It is said to be an ancient power that can construct transportation machines in an instant, no more making them by hand. According to Master Koga, the designs used by this wondrous skill can be found somewhere around here. If that's true, then we may recover the knowledge of the ancients and learn how to make all sorts of useful marvels. I hope we find it. The research team on the surface will be so jealous. They're working on something similar themselves. Glory to Master Koga. Glory to mankind. Hi, buddy. Bye, buddy. I really didn't shoot him for any other reason than I wanted to. Uh, okay. We get our, our schema Yiga schematic. Uh, we get some charges, which is actually kind of nice because we're going to be going back to, you know, the place. And then what is the thing for? It's probably for the weird fast car that we saw. Uh, sprinkler system? What? Are those fire hydrants? And if so, what is that, what is that used for? What's the purpose? I mean, that's cool. It might it might come in handy when we get into the, you know, lava place, but um into Elden, but it's kind of odd. Okay. Last thing. Well, second to last thing, I guess, technically. We're going to go here, go there, and then we'll go to, you know, then we'll wrap up the session. Hello everyone. Goodbye everyone. Later. Should be right over there. Cool. Unfortunately, I'm really far below it, but uh, it's not a problem. Oh, hello. Rome Canyon Mine. One last amazing treasure for the session, please. And then also some Zonite, which would be great. Because I'm about to be done with the deaths for a little bit. Oh, no. Okay. Oh, that was convenient. Sweet. The last light for the session, and probably not much of a reward for it, considering I just got the uh, the mine. But there you have it. If I can pull up my map. The entirety of Hebra has been mapped, and we're almost, we're like 40% of the way having mapped everything. Cool. Okay, again, this stuff can wait. Um, we'll, we'll clean that up later. Uh, for the most part, I'm, I'm very, I'm done with the depths for a while. Um, I've enjoyed myself, but I think any longer down here and both you guys will get tired of it and I will too. So we're going to go back to lookout landing and expand our battery and then, uh, you know, see what we can do. Ah, <sighs> civilization. It's been, it actually hasn't been that long, but it's nice to see. This is kind of our little hub world. And it's always good to drop in. Speaking of which, every single time we complete a major story quest, one of the members of that region goes to Lookout Landing. Hey, Arth, how's it going? Oh, look who it is. I told Pura all that's happened at the village. Without your guidance, I don't think Tulin would have matured so much in such a short time. Thank you, Link. Despite everything you helped with, We'd still be helping to find Princess Zelda either way. 
We retail are the obvious right pick for scouring the skies. We'll be protecting the skies and checking out the sky islands. I wonder if that's true, and we'll see them on the way. Hello! How are you doing? Uh, don't mind me, I'm just gonna climb up here with my awful shield that I should probably fix. Hello! Is this the only guy that does this in the game? Man, look at landing is important. Uh, yeah, produce nine more? Yeah, brother, do it. Get producing. Also, why does it do that? Hold on. What's about to happen? It looks like it was selecting our f the first level of our battery. What is happening? I refined your crystalline charges into nine energy wells. Let's go. What? How does that represent its... Oh, they're blue. They're blue now? Okay. I would enjoy further visits from you. Oh, that's cute. Bye. <laughs> that's all for my visit. Uh, okay, cool. So we have... We now have major batteries. I also would like to see this guy. Little little dark guy. I'd like to offer up some pose to him. Uh, I'm probably gonna buy some bombs. I just wanted to double check. So this guy doesn't sell all the stuff that the other ones do, but he does sell bombs, and that's a lot. <laughs> Ugh. Probably not. Uh, I think I'm fine. Yeah, that's fine. It's a lot of pose souls, but they're infinite. Come on. They're infinite, and bombs... I mean, bombs are also infinite, but... I, I need my bombs. What on earth? Oh, look at them! Look at them! They're flying around! That's awesome. There's a Goron here? Wait, was there a Goron here before? <coughs> You're a Goron. You should know the way to Goron... You should know the way to Goron City. How in the name of Hylia did you forget? Lay off. I'm embarrassed enough as it is. Besides, it's not that I forgot. When I left the city, there was la still lava everywhere. I didn't know Death Mountain would stop erupting. The lava would cool and new roads would form. You don't have to tell me there was lava everywhere. It used to be so hot that Hylians couldn't set foot on the mountain without fire-resistant gear. Even if I wanted to make a trip that way, take a trip that way, I couldn't. Well, thanks to, th to this guy, now you can. First, we have to walk down the road towards Death that Mountain, which you can see over in the northeast. Then we'll arrive at Woodland Stable, and from there, we keep going north. Thanks again for the directions, fella. Happy to be of service. Using Death Mountain as a landmark is all well and good, of course, but the red haze around the summit looks worryingly like gloom. Try not to get too close. All right, let's go. And on the way, we'll stop by that bistro place you keep mentioning. Now you're talking! That was cute. Uh, we're probably not going to be headed to Death Mountain for a while, actually. Like, a long while. Like, the end of the game while. Uh, is there- there is a goddess statue down here, I believe. Uh, there's... Yara, there are some weapons. Where is the statue? There it is. We should have four. I think we have four. We might have five, actually. We have exactly four. Cool. Let's get a heart container. And I'm not doing this on cooldown. I'm only doing this because we did something major. I think it makes sense. And hopefully soon we're going to start getting to a point where we hit a kind of a break point and we stop dying to... Ooh every single attack that comes our way. Although I've been better about it this session. I, I haven't died nearly... Have I died at all? Have I died at all? I don't think I've died this session. Like, I... Oh yeah, I, I definitely haven't, because at the very beginning of the session, uh, I found some fairies, and I, I found four or five of them, and now, how many do we have? Where on earth are my fairies? Did I use them all? I might have used- oh, we have two left. Yeah, so I have not- I- is this like the first session in the game that I haven't died in? I think it might be. I'm proud of us. Oh, hey Stu, hey Stu, hey Stu. Let's, uh, let's talk to him first. I was about to end off the, the session, but this is super important. 
I now have uh, two more two more weapons uh, weapon slots and then two more shield slots and then I'm gonna do what I was going to do and be all fancy. So watch 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 this. Watch watch how little you notice this. Okay. Next up, we're going to be revisiting some stables that <laughs> you like that transition. Revisiting some stables that we've we've gone to before and completing a plethora of, cl of quests. Visiting the Great Fairy, finding out what the glyphs do, all of it. I'm so excited for next session, and I hope you are too. Next time in The Legend of Zelda Tears of the Kingdom. We have an exciting session ahead of us.